Hi guys, welcome to my channel. So, um, it is officially February the 19th, my birthday. So happy birthday to me. Um, listen, so the video that I just made, literally y'all in life, I'm like so happy and very, very just, um, I was just drinking water. I'm like, uh, very happy in the place that I'm at. Like, and what disturbs me even about like, just finding out that a person would use my child or, you know, or try to go look at my kids or, because the funny part is, and I, I ended up taking a nap, like literally I dozed off because God was working with me with this all day. And at first I wasn't gonna say anything, but then I just needed to let people know, like y'all are not as undercover as y'all think y'all are. Like when y'all are creating these schemes or coming up with these plots and these plans, y'all are not really that undercover. And so I was talking to God about it. And when I fell asleep, the minute I woke up, I said, and I, this is really like less than 10 minutes ago. I said, thank you, God. Because you never fail me. You never fail to come through as to why it is that... Because... Listen, y'all people don't care about yourselves. This is the part that I keep saying. You will do something not thinking that it's going to harm you. Like, I don't know why y'all be so headstrong as to... Y'all want to keep these connections with people or deal with stuff that no longer serves you. Let it go and let God. And the reason why I even said anything is because I hear kids, there's a couple of y'all, I hear kids in the background. There's a couple of y'all, I see y'all kids come online. Like literally y'all will start shuffling and y'all start doing, y'all kids come online. And y'all will toss y'all kids to the side to finish doing that very thing. And that's the thing I was talking about about my son the other day. When, cause what I was doing was I was editing a video, but he said, mom, I need you to come and get in a car with me. So I just did it. And then that's when he tells me that he needed the emotional support and this, that, and third. Some of y'all be so focused on being in other people's business that you're not tending to your kids. And some of y'all be so, so focused on other people's business that you don't realize you damning your child to hell. And I don't wish no, nothing on nobody's kid. But y'all need to go look up the sins of the mother and the father. You doing stuff well, now later affect your kids. Y'all don't care about nothing. That's why I keep saying y'all don't have no rules. No, y'all don't. Y'all don't think. All you are trying to do is just be spiteful to a person so bad that you would curse your children. And that's not a good mom or dad. That's weird. That's weird to me. And again, I keep trying to tell y'all, I'm a defender. I'm a defender of children and and people who don't can't defend themselves. So I get real, real, real uptight because honestly, you couldn't have hurt my child no way. I already try to tell you. If you listen, listen, you would have never been able to hurt him anyway. It's not the first time, okay? Some little dirty being thought that they should do something to a car that he was driving. I keep trying to tell y'all. Y'all would have never been able, y'all don't listen. All y'all do is just do stuff. So the fact of the matter is, is it didn't, it, it bothers me that a person would even try to target a, a child, but it even bothers me even more when I go to see the person and the people and y'all have kids. The very thing that you could do to my, that you trying to send to my child could drop your child dead right instantly. Why would you do that? What type of parent are you? You love somebody more than you love your child? Y'all are weird. And y'all people who are hee <laughs> hee and this, then, and third, and y'all think that it's a game when y'all hear certain things. And then y'all like, oh, let me play on this because now um, we see this. You could be targeting your unborn kid just because you don't have any. You could find the man of your dreams and you love him so much or the woman of your dreams and you love them so much. And now you want to have a child and now you're barren because you dirty for what you done did previously. Y'all don't think. Y'all don't think. So, 
when I woke up, I said, thank you, God, because instantly he said, matter of fact, I'm not even going to tell y'all what he said because we be having conversations over here. But why? Why are y'all so stuck in... And this is just a lot of people. So just not, like I said, I'm not better than anybody else. It's just that I choose to try to do, God, I love you and I trust you. I'm trying to do things differently. And it's like, because I want to do stuff differently, because I don't want to be involved in people's shenanigans, y'all want to just target. And, and that's what I keep saying. Y'all want to take the purest things. Y'all want to take the most innocent of things and make them dirty like your kids. What's wrong with y'all people? You don't know how to go mind your business. Go sit down, go read a book, go do something that's going to better make your life productive. Because some of the things that I'm hearing, like I said, y'all talked about, a couple of y'all talked about just the most, first of all, somebody talked about a president, an ex-president family. Y'all got to be stupid, stupid. And y'all can try to clean this crap up because I know some of y'all going to go try to erase y'all crap and this and the third. <laughs> the internet is forever. The internet is forever. All it takes is for them to pull it back up. Y'all are disgusting. Why are y'all talking like that? Like, honestly, I don't know who raised y'all, but y'all are a curse. Really on the world right now and y'all think y'all doing stuff and God don't see you, he sits high, he looks low. How you think I got here? How do you think I got here? I was minding my business and he said, I need you to talk because there's a lot of things that's happening and clearly these people just don't get it. So maybe if I bring it to the forefront, then we can talk about it. And at the end of the day, I keep trying to tell y'all, I'm a person that I don't care what nobody thinks. That's the reason why he said, I'm going to use you. I don't care what y'all think. Y'all can't judge me at all, period. I do what I want. I'll do what I want. Whatever I feel like doing at the time, that's what I'm going to do. I'll go to him and talk about it. I don't need y'all to, to come and say, oh, she did this and she did that. Mind your business. I'm going to do what I want. So long as I'm okay under him because that's why he sees it anyway he sees everything even the thoughts that i be having sometimes that are literally because some of y'all i just instantly and then he'll remind me you gotta live in love you gotta live in love and i know this is bothering you but even still i know that it's this but you gotta remember who you are your heart is this don't let that affect your heart. And it never really bothers me until I see people thinking that it's funny to abuse their own kids. Because you're not hurting my child, honey. You're hurting them precious things that you got to the back. The minute them words come out of your mouth, you're not hurting mine. And that's how, that's how bad or that's how much I care about kids that I even cared about yours. That I'm saying, God, why would she do that? Why would these people target even their unborn kids? Why would these people target what they love? Because I'm him. I'm him. I'm connected. So when y'all open your mouths, that's why I keep saying, watch your mouth. Watch what you're saying. Watch what you say about me. Watch what you say about what surrounds me. Even y'all still keep tar targeting these guardians, and when I say guardians, I mean the, the business that y'all keep talking about. Um, this person did this, and this. stop talking about people because you don't know how connected these people are. And I might think they dumb, and I'm going to say that they dumb because I'm going to say, God, why are you sending these dumb people? But at the end of the day, mine, still connected to me. Still mine. I don't even want them because guess what? At the end of the day, they out there, but watch your mouth when you talk about people, like, because you don't know what position these people hold in his eye. That's the problem. Sometimes y'all don't even know what position you hold in his eye. And that's why he's saying, hold on, that's supposed to be, you supposed to be this under me, but you're doing this. 
So I got to teach you a lesson real quick because I need you to get right. And boom, everybody around you dead. You did that. Because he was trying to show you something that you wasn't trying to see. You were so caught up in being digmatized or being pussy whipped that you was worried about the flesh. You being fleshly. That is going to, you can get that anytime. Because guess what? I could have been fleshly even while I'm sitting here right now. He, he, he knows me. But I chose, I chose to decide to hack. I don't even want to, and at first I started to just be like, I could go have fun. I could really like, cause I could get past this real fast. I know how to do it. What y'all, y'all, like I keep trying to tell you, y'all really be thinking y'all be having power. Y'all got nothing. Cause I done seen some, listen. I was in the store earlier today and a nigga walked by and let me let you know he had on he had on his the armor. I could tell. He looked very godly. But he was out in his like in his gear. Like, you know, God know what I like, so you know, gotta be like. But either way, guess what I did? He came around there and looked at me 56 times and I turned my head, cause guess what? You ain't gonna do it to me, brother. I ain't going to let it happen. I'm going to go over here and mind my business because I got to stay focused. And it wasn't God tempting me. It was the fact that I'm over here and I done been by myself for uh, a couple months now. And, you know, my body talking. And she's saying, are you crazy? <laughs> What's wrong with you? And I'm saying, are you crazy? We got to act right. And and not that it's acting wrong, because guess what? I wouldn't be acting wrong, because actually under my covenant, I'm done. So I wouldn't even be acting wrong. Because guess what? Another thing y'all don't realize is y'all keep talking about Pisces is emotional. I don't know where y'all get that from, because listen, I know how to hit it and quit it too. And I'll roll out, and then I don't have people calling. Um... You ain't gonna call back, or you don't want who? Who you talking to? Cause I don't even know you. What what you saying? So I don't know where y'all be getting some of the stuff about the Pisces from, but this ain't that, okay? So yeah, y'all y'all might need to reevaluate and reunderstand what it what a Pisces really is, because just because I um will sit silent. And because I will shy away, and because I will, uh, it's because I won't be bothered with y'all. Y'all getting on my nerves. And this is the stuff that I be talking about. Because I don't understand why it is that y'all don't understand. You know, the thing I keep trying to tell y'all, God gave Pisces understanding. And why y'all don't understand that the things that y'all are affecting you, not me. It's affecting your family. It's affecting your kids. It's affecting your future. It's affecting your life. You're not doing nothing to me because I'm still over here talking, making money, minding my business. And even when I didn't want to go out, it was because he told me. Um, I'm going to need you to do a couple of things because... So regardless of what y'all actually really thought y'all was putting in there, everything that y'all spoke that was really like, oh, um, we don't want her going to work for this... <laughs> And then God said, I don't want you going to work because I need you to sit here because of some people that I need to see you. Y'all didn't do nothing but help me. Every time y'all thought that y'all was doing something, y'all not doing nothing but help me because I got on my armor. Y'all not stopping nothing I want to do. I do what I want. I keep telling y'all. At what point in time, y'all people don't hear well. Because I've been saying it. I've been saying it my whole entire life. I do what I want. Whether or not I sit and I be silent and let a person do shit 90,000 times. I already saw you. I just didn't feel like engaging with you. Just like uh, the one I was with for eight years, however long. Do you know how many times I knew this dog, this dude was out doing whatever it was that he would, he was doing? But guess what? I didn't care because I ain't want to have sex with him no way. And I made pretty good money. So guess what? As long as the next hoe was out having sex with him, I could be over here minding my business, counting my money. 
I didn't care. It wasn't that I didn't know. Why, why I'm going to care if I don't want to do it anyway? Let them do it. You helping me. Um, And then on top of that, like, y'all be weird. <laughs> y'all so, so weird. Y'all so, so weird. So just because I don't say nothing don't mean I don't know. <laughs> I be knowing a lot. <laughs> Trust in that because I be plugged in. I never stray too far away from where he telling me. And even when I go dabble on the other side, he know. He know what's in me. I told y'all, y'all understand my light and my dark. I understand. And y'all just keep trying to get stuff out of me because you want to know stuff. Well, let me tell you what I know. What I know is y'all getting on my nerves. I know that. What I know is when I'm ready to do something, I'm going to do it. And I'm not going to care about none of y'all. One, 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 I got one, one job, and I know what it is. If when I die, if I ever die in life, I got to get into heaven or hell. Me, what I did. Not y'all, y'all can't tell me nothing. That's why when this whole thing started and y'all saying, oh, you just got to do this. Y'all don't realize I'm going to buff the system every time because that's what I do. Because that's what I want to do. I do what I want. Let's get it together, people. Let's understand. Y'all are not in control of nothing that I do. When I sit and I sit quietly, it's because that's what I want to do. Don't wake me up and think y'all going to play with me like I'm a toy. No, that's not for your glory. Y'all woke me up, thought y'all was going to play with me like a toy, and then he woke me up, and he said, nope, that ain't what we're going to do. We're going to glorify, because some people need to hear that. And I know you're going to act how you want to act. It's okay. Be nice. Play with the little people. You know, it's okay. I got you um, undercover. That's why I'm going to keep you over here because I already know if I let you turn around. Y'all people better mind y'all P's and Q's. Stay, stay out of my business because y'all don't know. I am not y'all, okay? We totally not the same. Because I'm going to stand and know in whatever it is that I do and know that what y'all going to do. Y'all can't even beat me right now. Y'all woke me up and y'all can't even beat my my team. Y'all y'all just been playing around for forever. Y'all woke me up two months, less than two months ago, and y'all can't even beat my team. Now imagine if I really get wrong out here. They still gonna go. That's just what it ha how it goes down. Like y'all fail to realize I've been dealing with these people my whole entire life. Even on the other side, I've been dealing with them my whole entire life. I just be quiet. I just want to be quiet. I just want to mind my business. I just want to do whatever it is he tell me to do. I want people to stop talking. Because some of y'all, and then today I'm, I'm talking to God because I, I kept trying to figure out what these smells was. They was overlapping and crossing over and some other stuff. And then God saying, I need you to separate them. And I'm saying, God, who would think that I would be able to separate smells when I don't even know, like, really what's happening right now? And he's saying, separate them. I don't want to hear what you're talking about right now. I need you to separate them. Focus and separate them. So I started separating them. And then I started to realize one of them is a girl. Why would a girl be trying to... Because all the people that are giving me... That, that I'm trying to separate is suitors, sexual energy. And somebody smells like green tea. So he said, okay, now you working. I see you. Because again, I'm thinking these are all dudes that are trying to, and he's saying, separate them. Separate the smells. Because I'm saying, God, it just smells like it's a whole crossover and somebody smells weird and they're kind of fading out everybody else and then so it's doing this and then I started to separate them 
this is this because I know what this person smells like because they've been in, in my vicinity. Then this one got to be somebody else. Remember the rap song, he smells good. Okay, because somebody smelled good. Somebody smelled good. Then what was crossing over was this other smell. And I'm like, what is, why is that now invading everybody else? Because then a girl became like more, okay, then there was a girl. Somebody just smelled like, ew, dirty. And then there's still this person that is so silent, they smell like air. First person, I know what you smell like, not even thinking about. Second person, you smell good, but your spirit is not right. You got that thing that y'all do. Girl smells, but I think something is off because I don't even know if it's like dirty. Just stop because, ew, our chemistry not even going to mix because something is off. Everything about it is just nasty. Whoever the person is, the silent person that seems to be very, very, uh, you are just giving an impression, but you're not trying to invade my space. You are literally just watching over me. And again, because I don't know what this one is because it's not giving me it's giving me like I just for some reason I want to I want to know who this person is because this person they're not trying to control me. They're not trying to interrupt me. It's almost like they're just standing guard and watching these people. Like God would send a real guardian, a real protector, somebody that's not trying to invade my space, somebody that's trying to let me do what I need to do for God and not be in my business. And this has this is different from the first, what I was talking about. So this is what y'all people keep talking about. But whoever this last one is, I wanna know who you are, okay? Because the rest of these people, No, y'all epic failure. So go back and talk to whoever your people are. Go sign your contract. Contract done with me. And whoever the girl is, you never stood a chance anyway, because that's not what I do. Like that's again, when I feel like I'm having fun in life, that's what I do. But as far as my suit or my this, my no, not not even. So on a fun night, maybe. But no. So, silent person, I want you to not be so silent because I could feel you, but you're not being what they're being. They're being in my business. Um, but that was all. That that's <laughs> that's all the conversation I have for y'all right now because somebody and and for some reason I feel like somebody's sick. I thought that earlier today because. So one of y'all in this mix either has COVID right now or something, something. Because earlier today, I had a cough that came out of nowhere. I smelled the smell and then it kept making me cough. One of y'all smelled. And then That went away, and right now, while I'm talking to y'all, my nose is starting to feel stuffy. And that's not my energy, because again, like I said, every time I sit down here to do something, somebody shows up, somebody, something comes on me, because like I said before in a previous video, I was getting heavy cocaine use because I didn't know where my nose would run. And I've been fine all day, like nothing is going on with me, nothing. And in the minute I sit down to talk to y'all, something happens. That means it's one of y'all. And I've been shaking y'all off left and right because I'm tired of y'all. Y'all are annoying me.
Because again, like I said, y'all don't realize y'all are, y'all getting a baby cut in half. Y'all, I got stuff to do over here. And y'all not helping me when y'all are all trying to invade my energy, trying to be messy from the spirit realm. I don't like it. I don't like y'all because y'all don't realize that's ignorant. When all somebody has to do is pick up the phone and call me. Or like I said, you can show up at the door, ring the doorbell. I'm going to talk to you from, you know, wherever I'm at, but until I figure out who you are, but I'll, I'm open to conversation. I have no problem with it. What I'm not open to is all the stu stupid childish games. I, I'm not open to that. Y'all go play with them girl, little girls who, you know, going to run y'all down, chase y'all down. I'm busy. I, I don't got time to chase nothing at all, period, but my life. That's all I'm trying to chase. Make sure I'm living. And just so y'all know, Whoever was trying to target my child, y'all don't even realize <laughs> that that's a protector. He's a protector because without him, I would have had, I would have been left all alone already right now. When I had my uh, previous lifetime, when that first person killed me in life before, I was alone. The fact that I had him because you know, God been working on it even with him, making sure that he gets the proper attention and time because of the fact that's a guardian already. Okay? So y'all should watch who y'all put y'all mouth on already because y'all are y'all don't go look up nothing. Y'all just start doing stuff. So y'all can keep on because I like it. I laugh. But because of the fact that I know y'all have kids because I'm here in the background and I'm seeing these kids come on camera, it starts to make me now now God is saying the kids you protecting aren't even yours. You protecting these people, kids, breaking generational curses because these stupid girls don't realize, and yes, I said stupid. God forgive me later, but right now they stupid. These stupid little girls are so in love with a man and a stupid men are so in love with women that they're cursing their kids. And I'm the defender of the kids. See how it works? I don't even know you. Don't even want to deal with you. But meanwhile, I'm over here protecting your kids because you don't know no better. So thank y'all for coming to my channel. Like, comment, share, subscribe. And happy birthday to me. I made it. Another, another lifetime. <laughs> I got more lifetimes than me. Because quite frankly, that first one, I told them, I'm never coming back with you ever again. Ever. Silent guy, I need to talk, please.